ladies and gentlemen, Jim Crow Jill just made an announcement. She said, Jim Crow Joe's age is an advantage. Mm hmm. Well, maybe to her. So she declares Joe's age an asset as voters worry about his health ahead of the 2024 election. Jill Biden is aware of all the chatter about her husband's health, but defended him ahead of the 2024 election as his life partner of 46 years. Is there a part of you that worry about his age and health? Can he do it? So, she got interviewed recently by um, Mika Brzezinski, MSNBC. So Jill herself is 72 years old. During the interview said he can do it. And I see Joe every day. I see him out traveling around the country. I see his vigor. I see his energy. I see his passion every single day. I say his age is an asset. That's what she said. She, this is what she said about her 81 year old husband. He's wise. He has wisdom. He has experience. He knows every leader on the world stage. He lived history. He knows history. He's thoughtful in his decisions. He's the right man. He's the right person for the job at this moment in history. Uh huh. So, though Joe isn't polling well at the moment, Jill declares she feels confident things will work out in her husband's favor. I know that the campaign is going to be tough, but I am confident we're going to win. You have to look at Joe and what he offers, wisdom, experience, steady. And then you look at the other side, chaos, crazy. She's talking about trauma. She's trying to talk about Donald Trump. So there are two choices she shared. I think my greatest joy has been really the ability to travel around and lift up people. I think no matter whether it's celebrating teachers or whether it's going to do some disaster and people just holding on tight because there's been a tornado or a fire and they just, you know, all hope is lost and just trying to lift them up and give them hope. And I think that's my greatest joy is seeing how I can make a difference in helping people. She explained of her own role as first lady. So previously reported Joe has been known to mess up in his speeches or act confused. In September, 2023, he made it clear he's all there. I tell you what someone said, you know what? That Biden, he's getting old. I tell you what the president said to members of Sheet Metal Workers Union at the time. Well, guess what? Guess what? You know, the only thing that comes with age is a little bit of wisdom. I've been doing this longer than anybody. And guess what? I'm going to continue to do it with your help. So Jill is there cheerleading for her husband, you know, and, you know, uh, I mean, are you really feeling different about Joe Biden after Jill? Uh, did this interview on MSNBC? Nah. You know, Joe Biden is slowing down. He really is. You know, he does not have that same 
energy that he had, of course, when he was younger and a senator. He is definitely an old man at 81. And there are a lot of people, when you look at the polls that are done across America, that they are questioning his age. They want to know or they don't feel confident at all that he's able to continue another four years just looking at the state that he's in now. You know, there's only so much Jill can say. We have seen this man fall down the steps, up the steps, on a stage. We have seen him turn around and extend his hand to people that weren't there. We have seen it all. Or he seems to go incoherent halfway through speeches. Or he's just talking out in left field. You know, and that's been something that's been heavily noted over these last few years that he's been in office. So I don't know, you know, I don't know, Jill. I don't think you can clean up Jim Crow Joe at this state in the game. And we already know he doesn't keep his promises because remember, he said he was going to have the black communities back. And we haven't seen any of that over the last four years. So good luck. Maybe you have convinced some people that Joe was okay, but I know all are definitely not convinced. You're going to have to tell me what you think about this video. Please leave your comment and subscribe. Don't forget to hit on the notification bell and I'll see you on the next video. Peace, family.